Hi. I'm so sorry to interrupt, but I'm actually here to see Jane. Hi, Jane. <laughs> I'm here on behalf of the president to let you know that you're the 2014 Deborah Hobson York Citizenship Award winner. So congratulations. <laughs> so when the door had the knock and um, my name was called, the first thing that went through my head was something tragic has happened. So I had to do a complete somersault in my head when I was told that the reason that the team was there was to tell me that I had won this award. Um, so it was like tragedy to, oh my goodness, <laughs> at the same time. I was totally shocked and taken aback, <laughs> actually. I was embarrassed uh, and felt very humbled. So it was great. Jane emulates the Deborah Hobson York Citizenship Award, I think, in many ways. I think she's very innovative. She has York spirit, York pride. She served at York for over 20 years and she really encompasses everything that the award is about. She and I started uh, back in 1985. Um, I think we both were about 15 years old when we started. And uh, she's just been unbelievable in terms of all the things she, she's done for York and for students. You can always tell uh, that she loves what she does. She's incredibly invested uh, in students and in fostering their success. And I always think that that kind of positive energy is contagious. Working with Jane is like working with the Energizer Bunny um, in only the most positive of ways, uh, but she's got an incredible amount of energy, incredible amount of enthusiasm. She's really detail oriented. She sees a lot of uh, pieces that need to be pulled together. Um, and she's a great amount of fun. Again, she's such a forward thinker that she really, I picture her like on the top of a mountain and she oversees things that other people don't see. And she has this wide panoramic view and she's able to really capture that in a very innovative way and then make it practical. And I think it's that combination of the practicality and the innovation that really inspires me the most with Jane. Uh, Jane brings to the workplace uh, a vision, a bigger vision. She's always looking for the bigger picture. She's always looking for ways to expand our roles, to keep it new, to keep it fresh. She's always trying to push the envelope a little bit further in terms of what can we do to support ourselves as a team as well as the students. Uh, I've never seen Jane back away from a problem. Whenever there's a problem that uh, seems insurmountable, she finds a way to overcome it. One of the things that comes to mind especially is that she was the prime, primary driver behind uh, getting us involved in, in counseling disability services, getting us involved with the Scotiabank Charity Challenge. And uh, this was uh, Jane's baby, really. She, she put this on the map for us. And we now award uh, bursaries to students who are in financial need and who are experiencing personal, emotional, personal distress. We, we award now two bursaries each year as a result of the, those fundraising efforts. And really, Jane, without Jane, that would never have happened. It's really inspiring to see how much passion she has for the job after, so, after being here for as many years as she has. And I, I'll do her the favor of not saying how many that's been. My heart was warmed by the beautiful letters that my colleagues um, put in and other people in the larger university put in uh, to support my nomination. Um, I was just very honored and happy and my heart was very filled with joy.